what is it that defines a champion? Is it the money? Is it the spotlight? That the cameras and the commercials are waiting to catch a glimpse of him? And that he's there when the whole world's watching and chanting his name? What is it that defines a champion? Session 10, Dorka, take a bow. down in certainly in Indian history I think is probably their best player and there have been some very good ones I think he's one of those very few great uh, uh, players who started off looking special you know at the age of 14 15 anybody who saw him realized that he was a child prodigy the best way to sum up Sendulkar's technique is to go back to what Sir Donald Bradman said about him and that is that when Bradman was watching him bat one day and he said to his wife, come and have a look at this, this bloke bats like me. And he was talking about Tendulkar. I think he's the best player in the world today, without a shadow of doubt. No sportsman on planet Earth has ever had the sense of expectation, the burden of expectation on him, as much as Tendulkar has been. The genius of Tendulkar. They have been treated to something unique. Simply magnificent. This phenomenal cricketer. This little man is the nearest thing to Bradman there's ever been. Oh, oh sensational! The people standing up all around me in the box in Lebanon. This is that kind of an innings. The class players don't find fielders, they find boundaries. Straight down the ground, wonderful shot. is not impossible and that if you marry a phenomenal work ethic to the talent that you're born with when there's almost anything that you can achieve I started playing cricket thinking that one day when I should have this trophy beautiful trophy in my hand I'm a 
You know, immediately after the last match was over and then we had the trophy in our hands and then kept telling each other that, you know, this this tournament is over. We have won the trophy. Couldn't have asked for anything better than this. Having winning the World Cup is the ultimate thing and I am experiencing it. It's the proudest moment of my life. Six World Cups and finally it's happened. Yes, uh, it's never too late as they say and uh, you know, thanks to all my teammates, uh, without, without uh, you know, such fabulous performance and such consistency, it would never have happened. And were you able to control your tears? No, not really. They were happy tears, so I wouldn't mind uh, you know, crying. Well done, Sajid.